The day before Jessica and I got married, she sat me down and she's like, tomorrow we are going to be husband and wife. This means we should not have any secrets. And I was like, honestly, honey, that is the stupidest thing you've ever said. I don't know what they teach you in that yoga class you go to every day, but you have to trust me. The only reason you've agreed to marry me is because I keep secrets from you. <laughs> to which Jessica responds, no, sir. I say we lay it all down the line now so we are not caught by surprise later. Why don't you tell me the worst thing you have ever done and I will tell you the worst thing I ever did. And I was like, honey, you have no idea the tornado of filth that you are driving us into right now. And I am begging you, forget this nonsense. Let us go split a scone and speak of happier things. <laughs> and then Jessica says, well, I don't know if this will make you feel any better, mister, but I'm no angel either. I have done some pretty bad stuff in my past. I was like, what'd you do? And she says, okay, I'll go first, but I want you to know it is the most terrible thing I have ever done. I've never told another human being, and I am ashamed of it every day of my life. I was like, cleanse that soul. <laughs> and Jessica says, one time I got very drunk, and I gave a guy a hand job for cocaine. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and I did not know what to say to that. Because <laughs> I once gave a guy a hand job for cocaine. <laughs> and I wasn't even drunk, and I am not proud of the fact that until that very moment, I didn't even know I was supposed to be ashamed of it. I, I, I just thought that's how you get cocaine. You, you give guys hand jobs. It's how my mom taught me and her mom taught her. I was like, honestly, honey, we're gonna be up all night if we're going to admit normal stuff, too. <laughs> <laughs>